On January 24, 1969, after completing the first recording sessions, at American Sound Studios in Memphis, Elvis takes a winter holiday to Aspen in Colorado, with Priscilla and Lisa Marie, and some friends. In the book, Elvis and the Memphis Mafia. Written by Alana Nash. Lamar Fike, Marty Lacker, and Elvis cousin Billy Smith, remembers that Elvis got a problem, with Alan Fortas shortly before this vacation. They all went to LA first, and Elvis took everybody down to Kerr's Sporting Goods, on Wilshire Boulevard, and they picked out ski equipment, and clothes for themselves, and their wives. Elvis said, everybody pick out what you want. But all of a sudden, Elvis changed his mind, and decided, that he was spending too much money, and said okay, you all pay for yourself. And Alan got pissed off. He questioned the fact that he had to pay for it. He was only two feet away from Elvis, when he said well he can stick this stuff up his ass. Elvis heard him, and told Joe Esposito to get rid of him. I set up a party for everybody, that this guy is too cheap to buy his own equipment. I don't want to see him anymore. And then Alan got fired. Billy Smith explained, at that time, Elvis was beginning to feel like some of the guys were taking advantage of him. But when they finally got to Colorado, things got better. Elvis was not allowed to ski, because he was making movie, at that time. So he became interested, in buying some skimmobiles. Joe Esposito tried to convince him to rent, and Elvis did that with some few, and bought three of them. Joe remembers, that they used them for about a week, and then left them there, for a good friend. It was one of the best vacations, they ever had. They played Password at night time, and Snowmobile during the day. On February 1st, they celebrated Lisa Marie's first birthday. One time Elvis decided to cross the open field, and I decided to follow him, and we lost sight of each other. And all of a sudden, I felt down on a huge foundation, being built for a home. It was covered by snow, and the snowmobile felt on top of me. Lucky enough, Elvis saw it, and came along and helped me free. Joe Esposito remember this holiday in Aspen, as being one of the best they ever had. On the 17th of February Elvis returns to record more songs in the studio.